Now, disappointing jobs numbers for the month of June. Unemployment went up in Korea by more than expected last month, despite growth in the country's manufacturing sector. Kim Ji-yeon explains. Job figures for the month of June are gloomy, to say the least. The number of people in Korea's workforce was up 301,000 in June compared to the same month last year, the lowest on-year climb in five months. Statistics Korea says the number of people employed rose in general in June, except for those in their early 20s, with the employment rate at 61.4 percent, while the unemployment rate for June stood at 3.8 percent. The quantity of jobs may have gone up in recent months, but a lot of the people newly employed were found to be women in their 50s and 60s in the welfare services sector, indicating how tight pocketbooks have become among households. The youth unemployment rate of 10.5 percent for June was the highest recorded for the month since 1999. The real unemployment rate felt by 15 to 29-year-olds has risen to a record high in June at over 23 percent, up nearly two percentage points from the same period last year. The statistics agency attributed this to the shrinking number of jobs young people prefer, particularly in sectors related to science and technology. The youth unemployment rate has gone up, while the youth employment rate has sharply declined indicating that although those in their 20s are trying to find jobs, data suggests they're not being hired. By sector, the number of people employed in food and lodging decreased for the first time since December 2011, inching down by 1.7 percent on year in June to below the levels recorded in 2015 when the country suffered from the MERS outbreak. Luckily, employment in the manufacturing sector has risen for the first time in a year by 0.4 percent in June, largely due to a rise in exports and because of a base effect as figures were unusually low due to a recession last year. And this is why the government says it's vital that the National Assembly promptly approve its 9.8 billion U.S. dollars supplementary budget bill to boost jobs currently stalled over a month, saying a further delay would worsen the country's employment figures, making it harder for the local economy to recover and hit its target annual growth rate of over 3 percent. Kim Jian, Arirang News, Sejong.